Welcome to the worst. We are going to go through the top 12 animals that you're glad don't exist anymore. Starting it off with number 12, Arthropleura. Arthropleura was basically a giant millipede the size of a car. It scuttled around in the deep forest eating rotten plants. It was a vegetarian as far as we know, but with this thing's size, I could easily see it attacking anything that threatened it and eating it for dinner. Number 11, Bronto Scorpio. Scorpions are big badasses especially considering that they have existed in one form or another for over 400 million years. Another thing that makes this creature a scary badass is that it grew ungodly large. Bronto Scorpio was a meter long with a stinger the size of a cell phone. And the last fact about this monster is that it was a sea scorpion with gills and it was in fact the first animal to walk out of the ocean and live on land as well as in the water. Number 10, the Jakey Lop Terror. This thing makes the Bronto Scorpio look like a little puppy. Now it would be a little armored puppy with pinchers and a stinger the size of a football though. The Jakey Lopteris was the size of a crocodile with a hunger just as big as one too. It ravaged anything that stood in its way. Anything and everything was on the menu for this beast. It was also one of the largest sea scorpions in existence. I would have hated to be there surfing with this crazy thing swimming around. Number 9. Plesiosaurus. Plesiosaurus Plesiosaurus is often mistakenly referred to as a dinosaur, when in fact, it is a prehistoric marine reptile that lived at the same time as the dinosaurs. It had a long neck, four paddle-like flippers, and a tail. It was basically a long-necked dinosaur that lived in the sea. Number eight. Stethacanthus. Stethacanthus is an extinct shark which lived over 323 million years ago. Fossils have been found in Europe and North America. It was around two and a half feet long and was best known for its unusual shaped dorsal fin which resembled an ironing board. Small spikes covered this crest on its fin as well as its head. We think that this crest may have played a role in mating rituals or have been used to frighten potential predators. Number seven, Saurosuchus. Saurosuchus, or flesh crocodile. Now why the hell does it mean flesh crocodile? I mean, what else would it be made of? Rocks, wood, sand? That's a stupid definition of its name if you ask me. Okay, back to the point. It is an extinct gene of crocodilian form that lived 112 million years ago. It lived in what is now Africa and South America and it is one of the largest crocodile-like reptiles that have ever lived. It was almost twice as long as the modern saltwater crocodile and grew to over 40 feet and weighed up to eight tons. It had a six foot long skull that contained 132 teeth. What truly sets this creature apart from most creatures was that it was larger than almost all of the dinosaurs that lived in the same environment. And evidence points to a diet that included large terrestrial prey, which means this monster ate dinosaurs. Fucking dinosaurs. Number six, Helicoprion. Helicoprion is a large 40 foot long 270 million year old fish. It is best known for being the world's only animal, past or present, with a complete 360 degree spiral teeth. It is also nicknamed the buzzsaw killer. That's a big creepy fish. A lot of people automatically assume that it was a shark because of the way it looks. Now when the fossils were found, the archaeologists couldn't figure out where the saw-like teeth were supposed to go. This is a picture of all the possibilities that they thought of. Now they know that the teeth extended past 20 inches and the fish had over 150 50 teeth. Number five, Titanoboa. Titanoboa, meaning Titanic boa, is an extinct snake that lived about 60 million years ago. This massive snake hunted like the modern day boa constrictor, wrapping itself around its prey's torso and squeezing tight until the victim suffocated. Now, just like the movie Anaconda, this snake would have stalked its prey just like any other snake of today's world by stalking it and striking it with lightning quick speed. These snakes stayed in damp, cold caves that would have offered protection from anything willing or stupid enough to attack it. I mean, this creature could swallow a whole crocodile. I highly doubt anything would have attacked this bitch. Number four, Mosasaurus. 
This was the largest known species during their time, measuring in at 56 feet. It existed between 66 and 70 million years ago. In other words, a long damn time ago. Mosasaurus was also more robust than usual animals back then. It lived near the ocean surface where they preyed on fish, turtles, and ammonites, which were giant like snails at that time. Although they were able to dive, they did not venture into deeper waters. Number three, Anima Lacaris. This animal lived a half a billion years ago. This was back when life was primarily confined to the seas. This animal was one of the top predators during this world. It would grow to be over six feet long and it chased after its prey with flaps on each side of its body with a huge fin shaped tail. It grabbed its food with large spiked arms and bit into them with a square tooth lined mouth. It had insanely huge eyes which helped see long distances to attack its dinner. Its name means strange shrimp and that's because it's exactly what it was. It was like the Frankenstein monster. It had the body of a shrimp but the head like a jellyfish. When the fossil was actually found, scientists thought they were fossils of a lot of different animals. Crazy, right? Number two, Megalodon. This is the biggest species of shark thought to have ever existed. It is believed that it looks just like a modern day great white, but a great white can only grow up to 20 feet long and weigh about 7,000 pounds. But the Megalodon was estimated to grow over 60 feet long and weigh anywhere from 50 to 100 metric tons. It only disappeared from this earth around two and a half million years ago, which means it ate and lived among some of today's animals, like the giant sea turtle and whales. Amazing little side fact is that a baby Megalodon was the same size as the biggest great white shark ever found and recorded today. Now for number one, but real quick, hit the subscribe button for me. Number one, Quetzalcoatlus. This amazing bird lived among the dinosaurs, but it was likely the most scariest thing to be seen flying above you. It was as tall as a full-grown giraffe, and its wingspan is said to be over 40 feet long. This animal that lived in North America and was the size of a plane was actually the first reptile ever to fly. It is said, funny enough, by some paleontologists that it was actually adapt for life on land and not in the air. They say that it would have walked around hunting prey on its hind legs just like any other dinosaur during the time. But it is not determined yet which theory is correct. Because this animal lived around 248 miles away from any shoreline, it is said that it didn't eat any fish or sea animals like most birds. It fed on dead dinosaurs and attacked any animal that it could. It was the definition of a true scavenger. Okay guys, if you like this video, remember to like and subscribe, and here's two other videos that you may like as well.